Good morning everyone, my name is Christian from Two-Headed Wolf Gaming and welcome back to Graveyard Keeper. I had a bit of a day on fishing, so as we can see here I caught gold quality carp from the fishing rod, it didn't even need anything. Uh, sturgeon, we needed butterflies for them, so I collected some of the flowers. We don't have space to collect them all on this road, but we'll get them back next time. And then I caught a few other fish by using maggots. But I think I have enough for four silver fish fillet. So I'm going to go back home. And plan things out. Go talk to the gypsy king. Or master or what is it. Or however it's called. Let's pick this up. Then we go further north here. Into at our home. So there we have it, throw that in. Let's go inside the house. Let's see. What can I throw here? I would like to study this fish as well, see if we can make something out of them. But I what I want the most right now. Is to go for, so it says, like, what did we need? White fish fillet? Let's see. Where was the food? Silver star fish fillet. It doesn't, it doesn't matter apparently. Uh, okay, this is white. But this one. Oh, uh, can't I? Oh, blue. This is a blue fish fillet. We needed something else for this. Boo. And here I thought that we were good to go. Apparently not. So this will just offer us this, the silver, the bronze quality. If I go for industriousness, it might be, it might turn into something more effectively. It might, let's see, what do we need for industrious? Probably somewhere in here, right? That perk. Scent of gold. Carpenter, Mason, we already have it. Let's see, where is the Industrious? These are more monuments, which we should unlock. Writing, Bookshelf, Desk 2. Brewing, more fertilizer, winery. Big guy, plus one health, plus one defense. Engineer, where is industriousness? Do you see it? Because I don't. Which either means that we get it by talking to someone or we just don't see it because we haven't unlocked it yet. Which is also a possibility. Might be somewhere here. Or this. Or somewhere in here. Hmm. How very intriguing. But I guess we can't finish. Unfortunately, we can't finish this quest just yet. And that is boo! But what can you do? Let's throw... Um, no, wake up. I am going to throw in here. We'll throw the fish. 
Even the whitefish fillet maggots. And I guess that's about it. I'm gonna use this opportunity to add some more fuel into the oven. And maybe we can add some more fuel here as well. Let's see. 3,400. This is just, here is just a thousand. So what I will do is that we will use a bunch of these. And then ask it to to continue producing us goods. Okay, well, unfortunately that dream went away where we were going to... Oh, we have plenty of bees now. As you see, 10 bees. We are going to need bleach. Not sure if simple iron parts was part of it, but probably nails. Maybe planks. Steel ingot. Let's make some more simple iron planks. Uh, simple iron parts. And get ourselves all of these. Now what I'm thinking about going forward is that we'll need another porter, right? We need another zombie helper to help us carry the stones from the mine to, to our home. And even increase the efficiency of the current carrier. More beeswax. I'm gonna keep collecting some of this honey because I, I do want the extra bees. As soon as we have plenty of bees, we don't need to worry about it anymore. Now we have it. We're getting really lucky on bees on this turn. So I'll make one more here. There we have it. Well, let's look at our technology and decide what do we want to do next. A blueprint for a water pump. A blueprint for a water pump. Create prayer for excellency. And you know how complex mechanism work. All the details of your work are top quality. Even your carving and jewelry look cleaner. Here we can make it at a jewelry table. Where can we make jewelry tables? Let's check our home. Can I stop you? No, I cannot. So we're gonna take a look at home. Jewelry table. Jewelry table. We need lenses, steel parts and joinings. Jointings. Okay. Well, for that, so jointings we need Complex iron parts, if I remember correctly. Oh, for lenses here. Polishing paste. Polishing paste needs river sand, ceramic bowls and oil. For oil, we need to make hemp. Get the hemp seeds. Okay. Join things, we can create two right now. Okay, this is done. For steel parts, we get some here. 
eight. And I guess we need some more clay in order to create more ceramic bowls. Clay and water. Water we have a well here. So I just need to make some clay. And for that we're gonna go over it on this side where we can collect plenty of clay. Do we, don't we have space anymore? No. So what I need to do, first of all go here, leave the ceramic bowl, we have some more candles, throw in the wax as well, we'll come back for it later. The bat wings will need them downstairs. I want to leave the flowers because I do want to study them. That should be about it. I will take one of these logs back into a wood cutting area. So now we're getting one per dig, which is really good. There we have it. It is almost night time. I am wondering if we have enough time. I don't think we can get to the one who's selling hemp today. But as soon as the sun rises, I'm, I'm going out. Let's throw in the clay. I'll throw in these. Maybe the limestone too, silver ingots, why not? These continue to be produced. And so at this point, we just require ourselves the lenses. And on the lenses, we also needed some river, for this we needed river sand. River sand. We will have to go by the river, or by the... Uh, yeah, we have a river here, yes. Let's see, where was it? Here it is. So let's start digging for sand too. 10 sand per dig. Once again, plenty of points to go around. There we have it, it's going to be plenty of glass too. Great. Well, this is it for the current plans. Let's take a look at technologies once again. Because we are making jewelry, like that will going to be the first one. We're making jewelry and we need gold jewelry, jewelry details, I think, for the stained glass window, right? Let's double check it. Take another log with us. Make sure we clear the area. Here, for the stained glass window, yeah, we need gold jewelry details, yes. So let's try to go in further and try to pick something else. Silver injection removes one red and gives one white. Hmm. Distillation cube level 2. Some zombie alchemy decomposer. Like maybe we should bring in, instead of the one sitting by and farming, or maybe instead of the one carrying stuff. Some incense burner, marble columbrian with a porcelain funeral urn, stone sculptures that give five green, five quality. This could look good. Now this require plenty of blue points. These are mostly locked by the ones before it. 
In writing, inventing story, random text generator or study table, we can create a story ourselves. And then we could go for writer, sometimes you manage to write a good sentence, mother would be proud. Playwright, you write good books, actually you find you can just write down anything you remember from other culture. Random text generator from the zombies, bookshelf. Clean paper, paper glob, we can make a printing press. Brewy, a mug of beer. A brewing stand. It's very, <laughs> so much, so many choice to pick. Scent of gold. You are a true miner, you can find precious metals and ore more often. But it's still a matter of luck and energy. Let's increase our chances to make gold, to find gold. That consumed all our blue points. And if we can unlock anything else without blue points, then I might pick it. No, we cannot. So we'll stay with what we got. Yeah, no, I'll take the rest of them inside the house. There is snake. I am going to do sleep. Just for a bit, so we don't get that debuff uh, on sleeping. Good. Pick up the log. Go back to work right here now we have our steel parts as well that is great let's take a look over here i guess we just need to get ourselves some paper let's throw in the sand what i want to do now is that we need to get some paper in order for us to take our zombie friend and make him into a porter. Because here he doesn't have anything to work on. And I don't have any kind of quest for him. So what I will do is that I'll take him home. Or take him to the north. Let's see, do I have... Let's take Fleech. Let's take... I don't know if planks was something that we needed. Definitely nails and simple iron parts. We probably only needed nails, fleece, and I think paper is for porters. I might even replace one of them and bring the other one back here to see if I can improve his quality. Let's see, where was paper? Here, I think. Yeah, plenty of clean paper. Let's go out. Because we definitely need two porters there. We saw that they can't really work anymore because the storages are filled. We might be able, like, we can make two storages. One for iron and one for stone. But is that the most efficient thing we can do? Like, they'll fill up as well. So then what's what would be the advantage, right? So silent. Here it is. Like I can replace one of them. Porter station. Yep, I was right. So we'll make another porter station and I'll place it here. And I'll throw... Like... I cannot take that guy. 
I don't know how to make him stop. Let's see, take. Okay, so he threw down the stone. Let's see. I'm gonna take this guy, throw him here. Yeah, he's definitely better quality. And then we'll take this stone and bring it back here. Yeah, there's no more space. So let's see. If I make another stone stockpile. If I make another iron stockpile. Yeah, we can. I'll make one here. And I'll make another stone pile here. This will still work. Um, let's take this guy home, let's check him out. Let's see if we can improve him in any way, shape or form. Because this is one of the first ones that we've had. And so I'm not really sure we we were able to, to improve him, like I didn't know. But apparently red, red points decrease your quality while white points increase them, increase their efficiency, how quickly they move around the map, how um, quickly they extract resources. They'll never extract resources at the level that you are doing it. So let's see what we can do here and then bring him back to carry some resources for us. Yeah, efficiency is just eight. We can do this to improve it. Now, could I take him? Like, could I do anything to embalm it? Embalming. Yeah. We don't have anything else on us. Like we will need to get some of those points in regards to how do you say it? Like the silver injection it was or the gold injection takes two red and gives two white. At that point I think we could what we could do is take some of the parts and like replace them. Now we couldn't get any white points out of it, but... Mm, maybe it's only white points matter. Maybe red points aren't bad. But you need white. Maybe they won't even work without all the parts. I am not too sure. Let's, let's give it a go. Let's try this out. At the end of the day, everything is an experiment right now. Okay, well, they're carrying some extra stones and ores, so we can go home. And as soon as day daylight breaks, I think by the time we get home, Daylight will be around already, and so we can go and buy ourselves a bunch of hemp seeds. Maybe use some of them to... to make oil, and maybe we can plant a few more. Like, we could use our booster. Maybe our booster will provide us with extra, extra seeds. Let's see, is there anything that I want to keep? Let's destroy this. Because I do want to get some, the beeswax. We have so much honey. Like we could leave off it and just keep working and consuming honey. I wonder if we get special trade by consuming so much honey.
At some point I would imagine that honey is not great for your health. Like look at that, we've reached our limit, like we can't carry honey anymore. Yeah, I'm not gonna extract it from those trees. Maybe we should start writing some books to get more blue points. That could be a plan. Uh, let's see, so it's daylight, let's go into the town. I'm gonna throw these, the things that we don't need on us, we'll just keep these two. And at this point we can throw in 30 honey in these boxes, we might need it later when we work on some stones. And that's about it. Maybe we can, when we come back, we can go and see if there's any silver, silver starred grapes ready. Here is our friend, let us see, trade, you are already selling me oil if I want to, but I could get 8 seeds, you know what, I think what I will do is that I'll get some seed oil as well. Let's get eight. That should be enough. We have plenty of money. I think at this point we could also go ahead. Let's see, can I get some feathers here? Yes. Let's get 10 feathers. And this will, will bring down into into the basement where we can make ourselves some ink. Let's sell this. What I'm going to do for the next episode, I think I'm going to go by the sea and try to find ourselves some silver fish fillet. Because there are different types of fishes in different places. Like there's the waterfall, there's the river. I know there's the sea. What are you? Greetings, the meal is broken, sorry. If you need something milled, you'd better go to the town. That's too bad, but I have nothing to meal. I live at the graveyard. Keeper, nice to meet you. I have some old reserves you might find useful. Okay, just flowers, but you also sell hops. We could come and sell some stuff. Raft, repair meal. Paper with calculations. Wood planks, complex iron part. Paper with calculations. Paper with calculations, is it, if I go, where was that, here, engineer, do you think that engineer is what I need, here we have another grave,
Did I come here and repair it? Maybe exhume that body, come and bury it back? Like there are multiple places that have some graves buried there. I think there is something, like they're just too random. Which I feel... That they're probably a secret or something. Let's see here. What can we do? We can make we can make oil out of this. We didn't even need the seed oil. Well, okay. Now we know. So let's get ourselves some oil. And maybe use a few boosters to increase the number of seeds we get from the hemp seeds. There we have it, 20 oil coming up. And now I can make some more wine. Let's make some more of these juices as well. Even if we can't brew it yet. Okay. And here we can throw in some of these. Even the seed oil. Okay, polishing paste. And now we will have four lenses. There we have it. And finally, a jewelry table. Right there. Here we will need to clear some of these, so without further ado, let's start extracting some of the iron ores. What else? Uh, these as well, the pieces of stone. Now we're going to use all the honey that we have available to extract, the nuggets and everything else. Because otherwise, there's no place to deposit. Like, I see the zombie. It, it seems like he either finished or something happened there. But he probably finished. Because I don't see them growing anywhere. It's semi automatic, it's not fully automatic. Okay, we're done here. Let's throw stone, silver, lenses, steel parts, more iron ore, maybe some oil will leave behind. And I think that's about it. We should really invest in those monuments. Let's see. This silver. A bunch of iron ingots. Let's go to sleep. Apparently we're losing a bunch of energy from being tired. So we need a sleep. We wasted a lot of energy. Done.
Okay, let's see. Crafting. To craft gold jewelry details, we will need gold ingots, which are crafted at furnace level 2 or 3, but we didn't find. We found silver, but we didn't find gold. It's probably necessary to go out and start mining for gold ourselves. Let's throw in. Where is some of that quality fertilizer? Did we leave it up there? We might have. See what happened here. Did we get oh the silver ones are here? Okay, we we have unfortunately we have less. Let's see, boost fertilizer. Can I use two types of fertilizer like quality and boost? Oh man. Yeah, we lost the seed, one of the seeds there. Hmm. Okay. Well, this is not bad. At least it somehow it works. And for you, you are doing the normal grapes. I'm gonna continue having you work here. Yeah, that's about it. I guess for this episode, we've done everything that we set ourselves to do. Uh, going forward, there will be two different missions. One is going to be fishing by the sea to get silver fish fillet. And I'm going to go for that. I'm going to go look, look for it. And the second thing uh, that we're going to do is that I am going to come back and we're gonna start mining in the area. So I'll see you in the next episode by the sea as we continue to explore this world of Graveyard Keeper. I thank you very much for watching, I hope you have enjoyed it and I'll see you all next time. Have a wonderful day everyone!